back to another episode of Cities with John. I am thrilled to have you along for the ride today as we continue. Wait a minute, never mind. This is called Traffic and Major Train Issues with John. What is happening right now? Oh my goodness. So, uh, I was doing some detailing working on the next video and I looked up and we have got a major, major issue with this train rail just causing issues with other traffic pro I gotta fix this there's no um, no way around this at all uh, it has to get fixed so oh my gosh what happened I'm not really sure I mean surely just not changing that track right there was the problem there had to have been something something more uh, yes yeah, so I was doing some detailing and as I do oftentimes when I'm really getting into this game. I don't zoom out, I don't look around, I don't pay attention to anything that's going on. <clears throat> uh, yeah, so this is ultimately my fault. Um, and, well, well, we got people trying to escape. Run from the horrible traffic! Um, yeah, these trains are just backed up all over the place. I just don't, I don't get it. I do not understand uh, where these uh, where are these why are these look at this they're backed up everywhere they're not even making it over to that area uh, the industrial area out by the farmland they're backed up over here this is, look at that. I've never had trains do this. Well, I might have in my first city. I haven't in this city. This is all, you can go ahead and, and know that this is all based on turning off the despawning option on Traffic Manager, which I mean, I did on purpose because I had read that it prevented cars from flying across the map or driving through random grass to get the play. look at look up oh my gosh uh, is it happening I don't know if it's happening on both sides of the map or if it's just happening over here this is um, wow this has got to get we've got to fix this we've got to fix this it looks like it's not backing up over here so that's good trains are still coming in what in the world is this what is happening here Oh my gosh. All right, so note to self. Every time I have an auto save, I've got to look around. I don't know what, what is going on here. Cars are flying up into the top of this. What in the world? Okay, so we've got, we've got a node problem underneath. I can kind of see it glitching. Wow. Wow. Um, all right. Well, there's some. There's a extra node under. Yep. See, there it is. I see, but I don't even know how did that happen. I have no idea how that happened. Who knows how long it's been like that? My traffic is definitely getting worse. Um, after putting in the beach area and the uh, man, look at the train just backed up. Boy, there. Huh. There's not any significant, car significant cargo on these trains. Man. I don't know. Um, I don't get it. Nobody's moving. Okay, now we got some movement going. What in the world is going on? This could have been, uh, see this line is connected all the way over to the other side of the map. It's very possible these trains are going to start moving very soon. But yeah, note to self, every time there's an autosave, I gotta start, I gotta start looking around a little bit more often. And, uh, making sure these issues are, uh, 
making sure these issues are uh, getting taken care of. These one-way tracks might help. I, uh, I don't know. I'm, I'm not sure why. Now we're starting to get a little movement. It looks like the inbound line on that right line is is the one that's jammed. Okay, so this is obviously just jammed up all the way across, all the way across the map. I, uh, I mean, why is it, it's going like three miles per hour. Okay, I'm trying to get these trees off the line, not that that really matters. I just, <clears throat> my dad don't really know, don't really know. I've got multiple lines set up here. Um, the train should be able to flow through there pretty easily. But they're not even, um, okay, so now that's cleared up over here. So that looks like, looks like we're good there. One thing we might do is we might we might put in a one-way rail over here utilizing all these rails that we have. Okay, here we go. Now we're starting to move. Now we're moving. take a while for this to uh, decongest I don't know if that would be worth me Let's see if I can mess with these junctions maybe a little bit I don't know if you can I gotta make sure that each direction is just flowing this one included because what's happening there is now this huge backlog of trains is preventing trains from getting out of the dock area. So that this train's literally just stuck here waiting. I'll just tell them to yield. There we go. Get out of here. Go now. You go. No. No. Oh my God. I'm never, uh, never taking my eye off the map. Uh, you learn something new every day on this game, that's for sure. Or you download something new if you're addicted to the workshop. Alright. Come on. Oh. Yes. It's just... Surprisingly, I'm still making money right now, which, of course, I have the money turned off, but you would think with all this cargo stuck on the lines, nobody's making any money. I mean, I've got, uh, it is kind of tight over here where I've got, you know, I've got a distribution center uh, very close to a commuter track, you know, and I didn't have commuter rail going for a long time, and now I do, so there are more trains on the track. And so, I mean, that's understandable. You're gonna get a little bit more congest congestion on the rails, but I don't know how this happened. But I do feel like this area here, everybody is taking, see the commuter, the commuter lines are going through the distribution rail. And that, uh, that's not good. one way I 
I don't normally use the one-way train tracks. I don't know if this is a good idea or not. Let me just see if that makes them know they can choose either one. Not so far it's not. Okay, they're coming. Okay, here we go. Now they're going through there. That's good. The only problem is commuter trains coming this way are still going to have to go through the distribution center area. Um, <clears throat> let's see. Maybe. See if we can just we'll get rid of this right here. Oh gosh, I'd much rather be working on a uh, a tourist area. But duty calls, you know. We still have. Okay, well that guy made it through. Let's see if me make. Oh, here's one option we could do. Come off here. A tunnel would work. A tunnel might work. It could possibly work. Uh, it, this is not going to work at all. Um, let me connect over. Why don't we just bring it all the way over past the underpass in this little tree area here we'll just kind of do that and that might work um oh. gonna take a little finagling i'm sure this looks like a uh, roller coaster on the inside i, I didn't even really was trying to pay attention to yeah look at that <laughs> Whee! um okay well What's the worst that can happen? Let's see if we can get this train back on the back on the track, so to speak. Ugh.
right, so we went from 50% traffic to 77% traffic, and I am glad to have this done and over with. We still have some congestion on the roads, no doubt, but it's moving. They're not stopped because there's trains just sitting everywhere. Tunnel worked out just fine. Trains are going where they're supposed to go. It's going to be back to the beach very soon, hopefully. Oh, man. Well, I hope you enjoyed this little detour along the ride. And uh, tune in next time for a normal, hopefully, Cities with John. Thanks for watching. Bye-bye.